y'all fellas welcome back to another one today we're going to talk about eafc 24 and the the play mode they have called evolutions now i think i've heard that they can, you can do more than just one player if so this could be very interesting now most of the players of course they can change throughout time and maybe when the game comes out they're not silver or then maybe the stats change but this is a video for you to get to come back to and see if any of these players are still viable in the fc 24 to choose from so all these can, can become club legends and i picked specific ones i feel that i think i would use if they became better they'd be disgusting some of them so let's get straight to this man now let's start off with the silvers because this is probably what we're going to end up dealing with first maybe they'll allow us to use silvers first who knows turkey is the only silver uh, card in the entire game that has a five star five star the only one maybe next year will change and there'll be more but as of now ryan Cherokee is the only silver player with a five star five star now it's up to you whether you want ryan Cherokee to be one of your main you know evolution starter players because he does get cards in fifa so maybe you don't want a card that will get a card anyway you know it's up to you then we have a right mid that's 70 rated who has a as a left foot high medium i think he's short and lean as well he's got three a lot of positions center mid cam and right wing he's league one so pretty easy to link up he's also 90 90 on agility and balance which is nice how who knows how you can make him? it could be pretty solid we have kubo real sociedad four star four star la liga now kubo does get cards previous fifas i don't think he got any this year but for those guys that are into you know japan and some of their players a barcelona academy player right as well right there kubo or used to it was you know then we also have francis francisco Con I, I, i'm not gonna say that one but this card this one is in a ajax right now five six left footed you know high medium good dribbling stats though man like that's pretty crazy dribbling stats for the 72 rated card so that's why i chose him and we have a center back because maybe EA could give you a requirement saying no, no center back with 70 or 80 pace. Okay, well, I got you one that's under that with 6'8 height. So, yeah, this card is 6'8, medium, medium. But in EAFC, you can change work rates. You can change skill moves or you can change weak foot. And you got a card that you can change the work rates, 6'8. And you can give him pace throughout the year. And he could become insane at 6'8. We know how important tall players are in FIFA. So, yeah. We have, <laughs> but I'm not going to say your name, bro. I'm, I'm just going to guess it's, <laughs> so, you know, we got six, five, medium high. He already has five star weak foot. You won't even have to mess with the weak foot when it comes to the silver card. And he plays in the Bundesliga, right? Oh, Germany too. Okay. But he is German. It's easy to link German players. There's a bunch. He already has 93 uh, sprint speed. All you need is to focus on acceleration. And that could be insane. That could be an insane card. What is, what's his height as well? Six five. We have Nico Williams now. Nico Williams. I'm not sure if he's starting for Atletico Bilbao now or he's a sub. But he could possibly be an 80 rated. Who knows? But if he stays as a silver rated player, this is an absolute beautiful gem right here. A five eleven, medium medium, right footed, left mid and right wing, which is disgusting. 88 agility as a as a five as a five eleven player with that much pace and decent balance, bro. Player speed dribble outside foot shot nico williams man you know what i'm saying man? nico williams we have a bundesliga player here called holtman he's 6-1 left footed medium medium he's left mid and right wing he's got disgusting pace already man like if you start with this guy as a silver player all you got to focus on is shooting and dribbling and stamina those those are obviously passing too but you can focus on just three things at the moment you can leave the pace aside he's got that complete speed dribbler trait like this looks pretty interesting 6-1 yeah but could be strong too that be the next player we have is shade and again another right mid from bundesliga he's a uh, no this is brentford this card well this version is brentford i think he has a bundesliga card and a brentford Premier league card so another six foot player look at that pace look at the agility and balance pretty good for a silver player 89 jumping at six six feet plays yeah right mid and right wing yeah pretty good man one of the fastest players as silver card i think this card and haltman are the fastest silver players in the game as of now that i saw this year right could be next year too who knows the next card we have another uh bundesliga striker from bayer leverkusen who's adley this card um 
pretty balanced everywhere, man. High, high work rates, which I know might not be the best for some people, but you can work with that, remember. Left-footed. Bro, most of these guys are left-footed. Four-star skill moves, three-star weak foot. All you need is one weak foot, four-star, four-star. is doable from then on. Left, mid, and center forward. Nice position changes. Good, uh, good uh, pace for a silver. Good shooting. Good dribbling. Pretty good dribbling for a silver. Like, this guy legs for a 74 rated player. Damn nice, bro. We got Mukoku. If I say his name right, Mukoku. Four star, four star, left footed, five nine, you know. Good dribbling. Good pace. Not that good shooting, but this is a very good card that, you, you know, you can just, as they even showed, you can get him to be really solid. Is he left footed as well? Wasn't he left footed when I used to watch him? Yeah, yeah, he's left footed. Of course. Solid. Which is, I, I'd mess with this one, guys. We got Romero, which really just, I just chose because he's 5'5", five, five, and I was looking for a short player at this, at this point. I was like, okay, I felt like I chose the best ones from the silver silver cards. There's still more, but um, some of them may play, play from leagues that you can't really reach. But 86, 84, Romero, uh, Serie A. I mean, it, yeah, yeah, Italian, right? Now, it, let's say EA lets you use gold comments, right? Maybe under 80 rated. All right, then we, we're talking big now. If we're talking under 80 rated, guys, I doubt my Chorari 100% is a must do. 100%. I'm getting it no matter what. If I'm allowed to, my go to. I'm going to tell you that right now. My go to. 100%. 100%. Now, next up, uh, this card's, in my opinion, the only problem is that. No, 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 no. We're good. We're good. We're good. He plays in the Premier League. 5 4. The reason I chose this card is because he's short and balanced body type. That's a rare body type, guys. Short and balanced. It, the EA don't really give cards to players that are short and balanced. Doesn't happen often. And when they do, I like them. And he's 5'4", medium, medium. He can play left, mid, and right wing. And those dribbling stats, boys, we you almost have a monster. If you can give this guy uh, a five-star weak foot, maybe a five-star um, five skill moves, you're talking about a... Pretty unique card from what I'm seeing, man. Stamina's almost at 80. But that agility and balance is going to make him, make him feel on the left stick. Phenomenal. He's got the finesse shot already. Player speed dribbler. This one looks unique. Now, we were talking about creating our own little Milinkovic Savage here. We got Billing. He's 6'6". Left-footed. Makes him already unique on that left side. He can play. Again, you can change it to high-high if you want to when the game comes out. Hopefully, we can use players like these. Because you, you might be able to have a 6-6 six, six player that has already pretty good defense. Um, The shooting is a little, you know, not the greatest. Obviously, obviously this stuff is going to be worked on as you go. But mainly is the pace where you got to work with. And you might have that, you know, 60 or 70 set. All in 70 stats would be nice to have, right? On the on the 6-foot six 6 player. This looks good. Now, another CB that you can use maybe under 80 rated is uh, Mings. 6-5, high medium, left-footed. Again, if he's left-footed, it makes him unique on that left side. Dude's got a massive jawline, bro. But 6'5", guys, and good good defending stats. At almost at 80, 84 uh, strength, 86 aggression. To me, that's good. Now, this guy's already at 72 pace, right? He's 6'5", high, high work rates, right-footed. 90 strength, good defending stats. I, I like that sprint speed right there. Acceleration, not the greatest, though, but... He's, his height, I got him. That's why I put him because his height. This is a right back from Barcelona. I, I just put this one because I want to remember that I want to use him. So just in case I want, I want to rank him up. So yeah, he's not really going to be too mad, I feel. But, you know, he's there. Then we have a Costa. Now, this one's totally off topic. He has five for skill moves, right? But he's 5'3". And uh, if I can do some Argentinian teams, you know, I saw him play in the MLS against Messi, and I was really surprised. And I was like, you know, bro, if I get a chance to t try this card on FIFA, it'd be fun to evolve the player because he was really good when I watched him against Inter Miami. So I coached that man from um, Cincinnati. Was it Cincinnati when he played? Yeah, it was. Now, nah, wasn't he playing on a different team? I don't know, but I think it was Cincinnati. But yeah, phenomenal. He, he played awesome. So those are the cards, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed today's video, man. Which one of these? Let me know in the comments. You seem interested in to try. I think Cherokee, but the thing is, Cherokee gets FIFA cards usually. So I don't know if I want to mess with them. We have Torre, who could be a disgusting CB, though. 6A, guys. Oh, man, this guy could be disgusting. Uh, we have Nico Williams, who could get a FIFA card as well. But 
you know, phenomenal. We have, you know, obviously Ali uh, Sh Sh Skade, F Skade, oh, Shade, if I say his name right, Mukoku, Razor looks phenomenal. Adama is, Razor and Adama to me look phenomenal if I can choose them. But if I can only choose silvers, bro, all these, most of these, I, I could take a look at for sure. So hopefully you enjoyed, enjoyed today's little early view of what you could possibly get in EAFC 24. Okay, guys, catch you later. Peace.